Kafir Celtic's contribution to the Zambian game in recent history is one to admire. The club has unearthed some of Zambia's greatest talents in the modern game, such as Enoch Mwepu and Patson Daka, all playing their trade in the Premier League. At the end of the 2020-2021 season, the club qualified for its maiden appearance in Zambia's Elite League, the MTN Super League. In the search for future stars, on Thursday, Celtics held a talent search invitational tournament in Lusaka, which attracted 16 teams. Club director Lee Kawano gives further details. The tournament uh, is basically a chance for the kids from around the country to be selected to be part of our elite team, which we're trying to make. Uh, which will have about f between 16 and 18 players. Um, we're going to keep in camp permanently uh, with the parents' permission, of course. Uh, and these will be boys between the ages of 11 and 13 for now, because the 14, 15 year olds are in, in the other team. I think you've heard of the young crocs that compete in Division 2. Celtics is the only team in the elite division with the youngest average age, which is at 21 years. Uh, like we've seen with the boys in Europe, you know, putting us on the map. So uh, for Celtic, this has become a goal, you know, and, and it shows even in the way our main team is, you know, it's constituted mainly of young players. Uh, I know people think I've been stubborn not to try and get uh, experienced uh, players into the team, but uh, it, it, this is our philosophy and this is part of what Celtic is. For the participating teams, the tournament offered great exposure to the young boys. Yeah, it's, it's, a, it's, a, it's a very big challenge because uh, what we normally do at, uh, in Soroes with our boys, because they usually, usually win almost, almost all the games they play, but when they play the first game, the boys were a bit jittered because of exposure. This is, most of them, this is the first time being here in Osaka. But the second game, at least they picked up and they managed to win. So it's, it's, it's a very good experience. You know, if you look at uh, most of the teams that are here, most of them are from you know, the line of rail, okay. the majority. What I'm trying to mean is that most of them were exposed as compared to ours. And with them, this one is a very good exposure. And they know the competence and the thing are improving. Celtics hopes to pick 18 players whom they will not only nurture into football stars, but also educate. Nchimnyangandu, Diamond Sports.